Hello and welcome from Budapest. This is Hungary Reports from Public Media M1, bringing you a brief news roundup in English. I'm Arpad Sözci. Thanks for tuning in. If the European Union gives its OK next week, coronavirus vaccinations could start in Hungary before the end of the month. The operative group responsible for dealing with the disease in the country said that the first people to get inoculated would be health care workers. The order of those getting vaccinated would then be on a point system. On Wednesday, 157 people died from the disease in Hungary and almost 3,000 tested positive. The government has brokered a deal worth more than 52 million euros with three domestic food companies that will also protect 1,500 jobs. The leading pasta producer, Jermei, the dairy foods manufacturer, Tolnate, and the Hungarian food specialty producer, Univer, have agreed that despite the pandemic, they will further invest in their own companies, as will the government. Finance Minister Mihai Varga said that investments during the pandemic cannot stop since jobs are at stake. The European Court of Justice has ruled that Hungary failed to comply with EU law in some of its dealings with asylum seekers and establishing transit zones just outside its borders. Hungary did indeed close those centers months ago based on a preliminary ruling. This new ruling further stipulates that Hungary should have allowed refugee claimants in the country during their asylum procedure. The Minister of Justice responded by saying that Hungary will continue to protect Europe's borders. Official recognition of the linguistic and cultural rights of indigenous national minorities in Europe has just made a giant step forward. Thursday saw the European Parliament approve the resolution put forward by the Minority Safe PAC initiative that would see the rights of Europe's minorities, numbering 50 million people, enshrined in European institutions. More than 1,100,000 EU citizens had signed the Minority Safe PAC initiative so that it could be submitted. The goal is to ensure that no such minority feels disadvantaged and that their linguistic rights are guaranteed. Hungarian minorities in surrounding countries often feel discriminated against. The resolution has now been passed on to the European Commission, which will issue a decision on the initiative by January 15th. Cleanup crews have collected more than 10,000 liters of oil and oil-contaminated water at Siget St. Miklos at a tributary of the Danube River. Examinations show that it's mainly engine oil along with smaller amounts of diesel fuel. Last Saturday, large quantities of the substances had been dumped into a sewer used for collecting rainwater. Since then, cleanup crews have been working around the clock to decontaminate the area. Police are looking for the person or persons responsible. And that's all for now from Hungary Reports. But we'll be back live the next night at around 11.20 p.m. Central European time. You can also catch us in repeats and online. Thanks for watching and please be careful. Keep your distance at work and in public and wear a face mask. All the best and Bison Natasha.